Hi guys, this is Abhiraki Verma and I'm here to help you answer a few questions on Shri So I have a, I have a few questions with me here that is going to um, answer a few uh, things that uh, Rahul wanted me to answer as a prior student. So let's start, let's get started. So question number one is what is my background and why CAPM? So I am an engineer. I'm a computer science engineer. And why I did computer science, um, uh, why I did uh, sorry certified associate project management is because um, I am actually an advanced business process analyst and when I came down to Mumbai I um, I had a, a tough time finding a job that would be suitable for me as a business analyst and then I finally landed up a job as an associate project manager where I where I realized that there is not much of a difference in between these two so I wanted to set my career path ground straight and strong so I did CAPM Question number two is how was your overall journey preparation with Sri Learning and Mr. Sri Ram? So I am sure that we all do a little bit of um, research on our things, right? We all do a little bit of, even when you're buying something, you do a little bit of research. So I have a baby right here with me today. So we all know this baby, right? So this is our palm book guide, right? And we all know this baby. And this baby has um, is something that is recommended by the PMI to you know it's the project it's a PMI standard guide so it is the book that your PMP or CAPM exam is based out of so Mr. Sri Ram has done some amazing job I feel uh, with uh, by incorporating this book with um Mr. with the Rita book and it is just amazing you guys it is just so amazing I mean. Come on, who would have thought that this book and that book that they have made is going to just change your life forever? It's, it's, it's good. It's good. So plus with that, I'm not sure that like, people would understand this, but there is something called as 49 process sheet. So, oops, oops. So 49 process sheet is here. And um, this is something that is very important, I feel, for every project manager out there. Even if you're at the basic level, you need to know what this is. So, Mr. Sri Ram, this is where Sri Learning comes in. They will make you understand and they will make you learn this whole thing. So, Sri Learning is something that will help you to understand and learn things. And, you know, it will make things easy for you. So, now, if you're wondering what is there behind me, so that is this thing this thing exact i'm sure you might be wondering when i started the video so this is the ittos list so this is inputs tools techniques and outputs and um this is what i created when i got documents from uh Sri learning about the ittos or different of technology it is that we have so i would not i would never be able to make this until unless i had a clear idea of what these processes were or what these knowledge areas were about so these processes are something that will help you to answer questions so th that is where she learning comes in you know they will make you uh, understand things and they will make you uh, you know understand of how the questions would come and how will you answer these questions and how will you uh, tackle with these questions and what do you what are you supposed to know what you're not supposed to know like they're going to there's nothing that you can't know but then there, there are so many things that you know you can't just keep on reading when you go when you go to read this book sweetie you will you won't be able to remember the whole thing and that is for sure because um it's it's a thing because we have a brain i don't know you have a photographic memory but then if you you can't read 756 pages but even if you are a reader and you read it you are not going to remember the whole book that is for sure i don't know unless you understand what is going inside the book you won't be able to remember the what this book is about so that is where she learning comes in it makes it super easy super nice super sweet and they have and they are the sweethearts i mean i love she learning question number three is would you recommend she learning for capm pmp examination within outside your network within or outside your network absolutely because they have done a tremendous job there are 100 the people i know I, I actually interacted with a lot of people in my um, batch and I the most of them I know they have been already cleared the exam they are doing good and I'm happy and they are happy and I feel it is so rewarding for them because uh, because they are coaching us and they are trying to be with us and you know they're trying to make us feel better and they're, they're with you they're, they're going to 
there, be there with you from the start to the end. Start as in when you're starting the classes from the basic of project management till the time you write your exam, they are there with you. At least they keep on uh, sending questions on the group and then you need to answer. They will help you how to answer these questions. Absolutely, I recommend free learning because I think it is quite rewarding for them. And uh, because they do so much of work for us, I feel uh, that we as students as well can help them out a little, right? A little. So questions so uh th these were the questions that were sent to me by rahul and i think we have like two to three minutes i think we can talk a little more so a few things that i would like um for people to know so i know um so i have so i know a few people so let's get this way i know a few people who um don't consider online classes to be um great right well they're not sure of what online classes might be because even if you saw the whole video that will help you understand what she learning is about but then your main thing is like okay these are online classes so i'm going to help you with that because i don't think anybody else is you know trying to make you understand what these what these things are so um online classes are something that we don't that is not really popular in india i mean they don't people don't really like it parents don't i know so um this online class is pretty different even though they will be doing it once in every week so it is so it is a, a little bit difficult if you want classes every day it is a little bit difficult because you have your schedule these two have their own schedule sri ram and mr rahul so uh, these three all three of you have different schedules so i think it is very easy for you guys to understand that one day in a week is good enough for you to understand a topic he will be there to guide you to prepare prepare you for the exam you will be responsible of the content you will have to do the content and the only way to do the content is doing it by making by doing it easily take a chapter whatever Sri Ram taught for example he taught me what cost management okay so we finished cost management and we finished resource management now for example I finished resource and cost management together in one week in within the week's time that you have you can just take the god you can take the whole video and you can see it and you can read the book and you can solve questions you are prepared with that chapter sweetie you are done so that is how the preparation is supposed to be like that is why i felt online classes are better because it is giving us time to prepare rather than offline classes because in offline classes um you you are there it yeah it there is there is a difference in the environment that's true it goes into your head you listen straight and everything but at the same time you uh, they can teach you a lot and then you sometimes it won't even get into your head and sometimes it will just fly off it will just bounce off and you learn you learn and say what the hell just happened that would be your reaction so you need to really uh, use the time that you have uh, prepare, uh so i have when i was i've been talking to a few people and when i uh, spoke to a few people i realized that they have been asking me how long did it take for me to prepare honestly it took uh, i uh, i took classes i think from november to december and december just went by january just went by i took an exam in march so it took me three months to prepare but that is because uh, that is because i was a little busy but um I know a few people who wrote the exam in January or who wrote the exam at March end and stuff. I was I had planned for Jan, but it couldn't just happen, so I wrote it in March. So um, till the time you are um, very uh, you know you are there, you are, you are supposed to be there. Like, till the time you are on your schedule, you are going to do good. So I wish all the luck to everybody watching this video and uh to all the students and to all uh, into Sri learning of course and to the aspirants be it capm or pmp also for capm you guys you don't need to be worried even if you're with the pmp guys i was i was the only person in the whole group who had gone for capm you guys like youngest and the only person so yeah so you don't have to worry about it you're going to be just fine just follow what they say just try to be um just try to be loyal to your studies right just try to be loyal and just keep, try to keep the pace up and you know try to be regular that is what even if you don't like nobody's asking you to study even if you you say that if you have time fine you take your time not a problem don't rush but be consistent you need to be consistent this is what i was told when Sri ram and i spoke so be consistent you guys and i wish you guys all the best 
श्री लर्निंग ऑल द बेस्ट राहुल श्री श्री राम सर आई थैंक यू सो मच फॉर बींग देर फॉर मी एंड प्लस आई थिंक देर मे बी वेन यूड बी सर्कुलेटिंग दीज वीडियोज इफ एट ऑल यूड बी इफ एट ऑल यूड बी सो आई थिंक आई माइट बी लाइक इन अपकमिंग यूर्स आई माइट बी इन वन सम ग्रुप फॉर द पी एम पी एग्जामिनेशन राइट बिकॉज आई गेव सी ए पी एम सो सो ऑल द बेस्ट गाइज वर्क हार्ड एंड आई थिंक आई एम गोन बी इन टच विद Uh, Mr. Sri Ram and Rahul to see how they are doing and everything. But if you guys ever feel the need of uh and of somebody who you want to talk to, then I'll always be there. So my name is Abhi Vakti Verma, and thank you so much for watching me. Bye.